So we're starting page one of our holiday packet and we have distributing, using the distributive property, um, showing how many groups in each. Um, I accidentally cut off the first number here, so I'm just gonna add it in. Just having four groups of nine T plus seven. So I'm gonna apply by thinking if I have four groups of nine T, four groups of nine T is like multiplying four times nine. And so I have 36 T's. And four groups of seven is just like saying four times seven or 28. So 36 T plus 28. This one's a little trickier because it has a negative number. So I have nine groups of 4G. Think of it as just, if I just had nine groups of 4G, I would have 36. We haven't done a lot with negative integers, but when I have a negative times a positive, I'll get a negative number. So negative nine groups of 4Gs, I'm gonna have negative 36 G. And negative nine groups of nine, I'm gonna have negative 81. Now this one I understand it will be a little difficult because we haven't done a lot with negative numbers. So most of our problems, if they do have a negative number, you're gonna think of it that way. Then you might have a problem where it's written in this way, where the second number of multiplying is at the back. So just rewrite it. And put it in the front. Now it's something we know how to do. Seven times three negative 21 and here's a tricky one that we haven't done before because we'll do that in seventh grade negative 7 times negative 8 is going to be a positive 56 we haven't done something like this before so I'll understand if that one's a little bit confusing so here's the rule that I tend to use with multiplying when I have two positive numbers I have a positive answer. When I have two negative numbers, I have a positive answer. When I have a positive and a negative number, I'm going to have a negative answer. And if I have a negative times a positive number, I have a negative answer. So when they're the same, they're both positive. When they're different, it's a negative. So let's look at the next two really fast. Two times r, two r. Two times negative six, negative 12. Another rewrite, negative two, negative three r minus two. A negative times a negative, that's a positive. Negative times a negative, positive four. Hopefully this helps with your homework tonight.